Hey everyone, uh, my name is Alex Gupski and today I have this three beautiful prints, all three done using different technology. Uh, one is the C-type, which is the chemical process, it's a Fujiflex, and two inkjet. This print here is the C-type, the um, Fujiflex uh, prints are known for their super glossy wet look and you can see the way it feels. Uh, this one is done on the Epson 9000 uh, and this is the uh, Ultra Chrome ink. Epson claims it's gonna be uh, lasting for 200 years under normal display conditions. And the third one is done on the latest Canon and this is the thermal inkjet technology. Uh, you can see a lot of sample written all over this, it's because I had to send it outside and I didn't want to send the original high definition source file which I like to keep to myself. So uh, the plan is to uh, face mount all three onto the uh, optical grade acrylic and then expose them to hard ultraviolet radiation and I will screen half of the print on each of them to see uh, the contrast and we will see which one holds the color the best. I have a few off-cut pieces of black cater board and it would make a perfect containment box for the print and the ultraviolet light. I have exposed each print repeatedly for 10 hours at a time and after this exposure there were practically no noticeable deterioration in quality on either of these prints. If you think the UV light was not powerful enough, it has caused serious discoloration on the gator board and the plastic box I have accidentally left exposed to the light turned completely yellow. In my attempt to cause any kind of light damage to the prints, I have left them with the half of them blocked by a black screen in direct sunlight for weeks and still couldn't detect any difference between exposed and screened parts of the print. With these findings, I'd be comfortable to advise anyone concerned with print deterioration that it is unlikely to happen during their lifetime and very likely for many years after that. Thank you for watching this video and I would like to invite you to my website where you can find lots of useful information about fine art printing.